Okay, let's do this. Welcome to my fort. It's um not as grand as I was imagining on paper. Then again, I would kind of need the Weasley's tent to make the one on paper work completely. Lately, I've been making videos in which I am almost entirely out of frame. I'm gonna try to do better in this one and keep myself entirely in frame the entire time, hopefully. Although since I'm uh I'm yeah my den of Shmoolitude is kind of caving in on me. I don't know how well that part of the plan's gonna work. I have four minutes until Merlin starts, so I gotta film this quick. Tomorrow shenanigans are happening. Hopefully. With your lovely self, and my lovely self, and Laura Ralston's lovely self. Shout out to Nellen because I don't know if he watches these, but he's at Mansfield right now as we speak. He's moving in or something. I don't know. Yay, Nilin! It's so weird. I can I have the little screen up on the on the screen, and I'm looking at myself in the in the fort. It's fun. This feels fun. I like this challenge. I really do. Something that I want to talk about today because um, I'm currently typing up a very long Tumblr post, and I've been working on it a lot today in response to a religious. Facebook status. Maybe this should be like a thing. A thing that we do. Meaningful discussions from the fort. Now, first I want to make it clear that I have no grudge against any particular religion or the displaying of one's religion on Facebook. If you believe in something, be it a higher power or karma or just life, the world itself, people, that's great. That's a really good thing. And I truly respect people who have the, the conviction that I often find I lack in order to be able to completely trust something, even themselves. What I frown upon is when people believe that their opinion or their... What I frown upon is when people uh, think that their religious beliefs invalidate others. Like, Emma is a Christian. She's a Catholic. I'm not a Christian or a Catholic. But I'm okay with the fact that she is, as long as she's not trying to force her beliefs on me, or trying to claim that her being a Catholic makes her better than me in some way, or more intelligent or correct than me, that's not okay. What in the name of Albus Dumbledore is going on up there? Because I feel like the real point of any valid religion Valid here having the meaning of anything that- oh dear. Oh good lord. Hi. Hi. Who's down here? Maggie. Maggie who? I'm going to clean it up as soon as I'm done. Who's in there with you? The internet. <laughs> Valid here having the meaning of everything except, like, Satanism and Scientology, maybe. Is to encourage people to do good things and be good people. And it functions basically on the idea of positive reinforcement, meaning good people are rewarded and bad people are punished. So I don't get it when people are bringing other people down based on beliefs. It's not, it's not right. It's not cool. You need to, you need to stop and just live and let live. Have I told you that I really like the fort challenge? <laughs> I need a challenge for you. I kind of wish that you were in the fort with me. I feel like that would make the video a lot better if we were both in here. Alas, I am at my house and you are at yours. It's such a pity that we don't live in an age where technology connects everyone. Oh wait. So... Good morning, love. Yes. Don't forget to be awesome. Thank you either. <laughs> bye, Maggie. He says bye also. <laughs> okay. What is under there? A ginger. My challenge this week was to make a fort.